Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am so freaking excited to do this review again. I have done a mukbang, my first ever mukbang about Japanese um, cup noodles and clear coke. If you haven't watched that, I put the links down below. And today I'm going to do another review for the Japanese bottle drink. And I bought four drinks. I haven't done this like, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Um, they are this one. It says um, Zonda Cream Soda. And the other one is um, Cold Priest Soda. So I assume they both soda. And you know, the legendary Clear Coat. I've done a review on this, so if you haven't watched that, go back to the, my, um, my other one. I put the links down below. And this one is the Milk Tea. My friend recommended it, so I have to do it. Anyway, I just got back from my trip to Osaka and Kyoto. That was insanely awesome. I walked for like 20 kilometers. I think it was 19-ish, yeah, 19-ish, 20 kilometers in just like within 20 hours that I was there. Like the just for the, the traveling to those two cities alone. Anyway, let's start with one of these. I don't know which one to choose. Carl Piss Soda. It's very milky. You know, I'm gonna start with this. And yeah, there's a lot of gas inside, bubbles, so I don't know what to expect. Is it like gonna be like an energy drink? This one is made in Japan, of course. I cannot read any Japanese, so let's go. Yeah, let's go. Oh my god. Whoa. Whoa, there you go. Ooh, look at... Did you see... Wait. Oh, you didn't see the smoke. Anyway, let's go. Ooh. Ooh. Wow. It tastes kind of funny to me. Wait, hang on. First of all, this is like, like a steak soda, you know, so you expect a lot of gas in it. And the aftertaste, it tastes like yogurt mixed with Sprite. Yeah, it tastes like yogurt mixed with Sprite. Ooh. I know I, I said it tastes funny, but I can't stop drinking it. Oh my god. Yeah, it tastes like yogurt mixed with um, Sprite or 7-Up. Very interesting. I, I don't know if you could tell. Yeah, there you go. See? Very milky and like so many bubbles. Whoa, this is really interesting. I did not expect it to be like this, you know? I thought it was going to be like, you know, one of those um, energy drink, but this is interesting. Whoa, and like if you shake it a little bit, I shouldn't, but I do. In any way, you can see like uh, the white stuff, the foam is forming on the top. Whoa, this is very interesting. Let me know in the comment section down below what do you guys think. Have you tried it? Like, should I do a similar drink to this? Okay, I'm going to rinse my mouth with some water, so it's not going to ruin the, the, the other taste. Oh, I'm gonna be quick. It's four minutes already. Okay, let's start with the second one. This one, it I don't know what it's called. It says Zunda Cream Soda on here. Wait, and it's quite milky as well. If you could see it, uh, it says soda, so I expect something good, right? Okay, let's go. Oh, you can hear the gas, but it's not as gassy as the other one. Wait, let's try. In? Mm, mm, wait. Wait, hold on. Hold on. What the hell? It tastes like a dessert. Literally, it has a picture of a. I did What is it? A matcha? Yeah, it tastes like this one. But in a liquid form. Interesting. And it's from a company called Poka Sapporo. So I assume this was made in Hokkaido. Wow. Interesting. Not my favorite compared to the other one, but yeah. Mm. Actually, I don't like it. I'd rather eat a dessert, but this one is a bit weird. I'm gonna save it for my cousin, and like, she hasn't tried it, so we'll see how it goes. Water again. Mm. Okay, let's do the third drink. I'm gonna be super fast, because this one is milky, and it says relax on here. Yeah, um, my friend. She recommended it and I hope it's good and some like particle is formed right here so I have to shake it well. 
otherwise I won't get like a full taste of it because you know like especially with milk tea if you don't mix it well you're gonna see like some particles suspended in the drink so I have to shake it well before I drink it and I expect this one to be like as a regular milk tea it said afternoon tea has been drunk by oh excuse me oh my god the burp oh, <laughs> oh my god I am so sorry guys I think I'm not gonna cut this I, I wanna like keep it as authentic as possible anyway yeah interesting let's go Ooh. oh it smells like your normal milk tea mmm ooh whoa the smell is very pungent maybe like some of you don't even smell this but I do the smell like if you just like sniff it like this it does not really smell that bad but you know like when you drink it mm, you got the aftertaste this one tastes like Earl Grey mixed with sugar and um, milk of course I normally drink Earl Grey as well because I love the, the, the fragrance of it but I normally drink it like just straight up with nothing with no sugar just like hot water and the tea bags itself and this one is a bit a bit weird to me but oh I, you know what I would enjoy this with like some ice cube and like you know like the black pearl or um, coconut jelly that you could buy it at the bubble tea store actually not that bad the more you drink of it but you know some people might not be a big fan of the fragrance does you know the, the smell of the tea because Earl Grey I think I don't know what kind of tea that they use like is that oolong is it um green tea is it some other tea definitely not jasmine and I don't think they use um oolong as well I think it's either green tea or Earl Grey but maybe I'm wrong let me know in the comment section down below have you tried this what did you guys think and yeah let's move on to the legendary clear coat I did a review of this earlier in my mukbang and oh my god like this is like probably the best taste of coke that I have ever drunk in my life anyway I'm gonna rinse my mouth again third time <laughs> this is like really lovely if you're ever in Japan like come to Japan and buy this if you get it at the vending machine normally it costs a hundred yen but if you get it at the supermarket it's slightly different I bought a lot of bottles I bought like five bottles so like little here and there make up a small amount a uh, large amount that's what I meant this one tastes amazing let's go Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> oh my god oh did you see this okay let's go oh my god I love it I'm not sure if the lemon is the original taste because they have the lemon skin on this three two one let's go mmm -hmm. ah it tastes like your normal coke but with a twist of like you know the lemon zest in it yeah, uh, I just love it. There's another Coke that's called Coca-Cola Plus. I haven't tried that. I've seen it and I forgot to buy it. Anyway, this tastes amazing. Out of the four, I would say these two are my favorite. This one tastes like a little bit of yogurt, but if you, uh, you know what, crushed ice would taste amazing with this. This one is my least favorite because I'm not a big fan of, you know, the dessert drink. It's, it's a bit weird, but yeah. Anyway, let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think. What do you want me to do? Um, other stuff as well. I think by the time I post this video, I'll, I'll probably be gone in um, in Japan. You, I'll probably go to the supermarket and buy some more Japanese snacks to do a full review but thank you very much for watching my video i hope you enjoy it and don't forget to check out my other stuff as well especially my vlog in indonesia cambodia thailand singapore around australia and this one in japan yes follow me on instagram thank you very much and see you guys next time have a good day